Hello everyone and welcome once again to another edition of the Red Brown and Williams Real Estate Show. I'm Shannon Deskins along with Jennifer Brown Day and fingers crossed I think we finally hit that mark of summer temperatures. We definitely have gotten warmer that's for sure and with the spring mm -hmm. now going into summer we're really starting to see the listings the sales start picking up so we're excited for the season for more than one reason. And it's a season for drive-bys mm -hmm. when especially when school lets out and people kind of get stir crazy with all the kids at home they'll get out and start driving by so pay attention and watch for those Red Brennan Williams signs but as we mention all the time any realtor sign they can call you guys you guys can show and sell that home absolutely and keep in mind you know we have offices in four different locations in mm -hmm. eastern kentucky so any sign that you see anywhere in eastern kentucky one of our offices can help you out and we're going to show you four listings and then we're going to talk about an auction mm -hmm. that's coming up at the end of the show uh, but the first one is right in downtown pikeville it is or in, in pikeville not necessarily downtown right uh, this is one, it's at seven, 177 Walnut Street, which is in Poly Edition. We've mm -hmm. talked about this one before, and this is one that's just recently reduced. But the reason that it's on the show this time, this listing and our next listing, we're going to have an open house on both of them. This coming Tuesday, which is the 14th. Right. From noon until 1 p.m. This is something that a realtor can come to, bring clients, or if you're in the area and you have any interest, feel free to stop in. And this is even better than a drive-by because mm -hmm. this one you can actually walk in, walk through the house, no pressure, just kind of get the feel of if this is something you really want to look into even more. Right. And again, that's Tuesday, this coming Tuesday, May 14th from noon until 1. Mm -hmm. Now this house is not a small one. It's a very large house on a huge lot. It is. This is over 3,000 square feet on an acre and like you said in Pikeville mm -hmm. so it's a great area great location and a lot of space. I love this location because it's the neighborhood that's next to the Poly Bridge mm -hmm. which is a walking bridge which allows you bike or walking access into the downtown area so it's a great great area if you're an active family. If you want to have a small little neighborhood for the kids to ride their bike or something like that, or if you're a runner and you want to mm -hmm. go for a five mile run, everything is super convenient. And the, the inside of this, we talked about how huge it is. The other thing that we want to mention is a ranch home because mm -hmm. that a lot of people, they want that one level home. Yeah, it's a one level home. And the great thing about this one is it's what it is a sprawling ranch. So you mm -hmm. have a lot of space. This has two master suites. So you have two bedrooms with attached bathrooms, one kind of on each end of the house. And that big backyard mm -hmm. uh, is fenced in. And so you've got that fenced area in the back too for it. So it's great for pets and children. Yes, and the great thing is they have both. So mm -hmm. they actually have multiple fences. You can actually yes. have the kids in one part of the yard, have the dogs in one part of the yard, and they're actually completely separated. Right, so you've got a lot of options on this house. Uh, but remember on Tuesday, May 14th, if this mm -hmm. is something you want to look at, show up, 117 Walnut Street in the poly edition and you'll have the door open in there with your big smiling face. Absolutely, you might even have a cookie. There you go. <laughs> 3299 is the price on this one. It's been reduced, so if you're in the market for that one, give Jennifer a call. Let's give that Pikeville office number. Okay, the number is 606-437-2333. All right, now we mentioned that there's going to be another open house that day, mm -hmm. and this one is at Foxcroft. It is. This one is, like you said, at Foxcroft. You're going to go about halfway up the hill. The house will show, show up on your right, mm -hmm. and you're going to know you're at the right house because it's the roundhouse. <laughs> it's the roundhouse, and we've talked about it before. And this is one that I may not necessarily be in the market for a house, but I want to go in and see this. We've <laughs> talked about it. And one thing is around house, you always mention the use of space. Yes. Sometimes they are very difficult layouts just because you're dealing with a circle. So you can imagine how hard it is with walls mm -hmm. and that kind of stuff. This is one of the most functional laid out roundhouses that I've been in. So you have a huge living room, huge rooms, open mm -hmm. rooms, lots of light. That second floor, which is the second floor down, not right. up, is actually an entire master suite. So a huge master suite, plus then you go down to the very bottom level, you've got another family room, bathroom, 
it's just got a lot of space in it and it's very deceiving. And one of the pictures that we show is that living room picture and those floor to ceiling windows. Mm -hmm. I mean, imagine the natural light that comes into this house. Yes. Plus you're up on the mountain. So you're gonna get that feel of being at the, the cabin, the resort feel, mm -hmm. but that's gonna be home. Absolutely, it's gonna be home. And this is technically a gated community. Mm -hmm. So um, it usually is a little bit harder to do a walkthrough on it. Right. So if you have an interest on this one, it's a great time to come. Again, this one is going to be open at the same time as the Poly mm -hmm. Edition home, Tuesday, May 14th from noon until 1, and there'll be one of your realtors there mm -hmm. to greet everybody, answer any questions about the home, and maybe schedule a second showing. Absolutely. Okay, now moving to the next listing. This is actually a townhouse, and this one is a new listing. It is. This is a new listing, and this is going to be another great location. You're right off Main Cedar Creek Road, mm -hmm. about a half mile up from where 23 and Cedar Creek meet right there, um, right off the 23 exit. So this is one, again, super great location, close to schools, close to downtown, close to parks, trails, all of that. If you're in the market for a townhome, this is one you definitely need to look at because I've personally been in, in this section of townhouses on Cedar Creek and they're much larger on the inside than yes. they look on the outside. Yes, absolutely. And this is one, again, a townhouse can have very limited space. They can have a little bit of a different, difficult layout. This is one that they have really used the space well. You have a very functional layout, living room, kitchen, um, and then on the first floor, you also have a master bedroom. So you do have that first floor bedroom, which mm -hmm. people love. The second floor is pretty much entirely a second master suite. Wow. And one thing you don't see from the front when you're driving up Cedar Creek is you don't realize on the back side of this house, there's a garage. Yes, you do have a one car garage. They actually, um, there's a small deck back there. They actually went in and increased the size of the deck. So you have a little bit more outdoor space back there. So private parking, townhouse, very little maintenance. Uh, they're less than 15 years old. So they're, they're not very old. And this one specifically is right under 1600 square feet. So good size and uh, not that old. And this is your listing at 224. So let's give your email address. Okay, the email is jbrown at rbnw.com. Okay, now the next one we're gonna talk about is another relatively new listing, but this mm -hmm. one is at Shelby Anna. It is, and this is one I like talking about it just because this is one you really, really have to see. Mm -hmm. It's super easy to do a drive-by and you know, I recommend doing it, but if you have an interest in being in this area, this is one you really have to see the inside. And this happens a lot because a lot of times the outside is deceiving. Sometimes mm -hmm. you don't realize how much space is on the inside. Um, and so many other things, you know, how big the rooms are or maybe what you want to feature about a home isn't seen from the outside. Exactly. This one fits that description. It's a, a two bedroom, one bath, original hardwood flooring, original woodwork, mm -hmm. and it has been kept pristine. It's in great condition. And then you've got a second uh, the, the mobile home mm -hmm. on this one as well. So you, you're actually getting an additional spot if you've got some relatives or things like that or you want rental property. Yeah, and it's directly behind you, kind of up on the hill. Now, the main house has a bottom level that is an unfinished basement, but you've got storage space, mm -hmm. and you can look at developing that into, you know, a craft room or anything like that, workshop or workspace. That's basically free space not included in your square footage. Yes, that's not included in the square footage, and it's also road level. So, mm -hmm. you know, you're in an area that doesn't have zoning. So if you want to change that into some kind of commercial space, a small little store, anything mm -hmm. like that, you're also in a great location to do something like that because you are right on the road. Right. We say Shelby Anna, so you're right off of 460. Mm -hmm. So, you know, you're near that area where on the Shelby side where the Food City is. Mm -hmm. You just take Veer off there and go up 460, and this is not far from there. No, not far at all. You're only about a mile and a half off of US 23, and you're right before you get to the Chloe Road area and all that. And then across the street, you actually already have um, that little shopping area set up. Mm -hmm. So it's already in that area. Again, it's just a lot of possibilities. And it's very accessible as far as US 23 mm -hmm. and Pikeville and all that, but you're just enough outside to get out of the hustle and bustle mm -hmm. of all that traffic that US 23 has to offer. So yeah, I agree with you on this one. And the price at just over, 10, it's 1099, so mm -hmm. under 110,000, you're getting the house, you're getting the mobile home, you're getting the land, and you're getting a great location. Yeah, exactly. 
Let's give that Pikeville office if anybody is interested in taking a good look at this one. This, the number is 606-437-2333. All right, we've shown you some listings that you guys have, but now let's talk about an auction that is coming up. Now, this is an absolute auction, different from a reserve auction. Mm -hmm. This one will sell. Yes, it will sell that day. Absolute auction means there is no minimum. Mm -hmm. So if we have five people show up, if we have 50 people show up, wherever we end, wherever the last bid is, that's where it's going to sell. Um, and this is one... Talk about location. Wow, yeah. Great location, right close to UPIC. Now this is one that's gonna be great for someone that's looking to maybe expand and, and purchase another mm -hmm. rental property or get started in rental properties because this being almost on campus at mm -hmm. UPIC, there's no question that you're gonna be able to keep a tenant. Yes, absolutely. You're gonna have tenants. This is walking distance to UPIC, to the medical school, and it is a duplex. So you have two units in this one building. Um, they do already have tenants in place, mm -hmm. so you do have leases that are already in place, which for any investor to buy a property and auto have automatic income, yes, that's a major bonus. Um, and each unit is a two bedroom, one bath unit. Which is perfect for uh, a college student. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, you've got your undergrads, but then you've got your medical professionals and, and all of that that are going to be coming in. So this could be a perfect housing option for a lot of people. Yes. Absolutely. But like we said, the auction will be May 18th. Mm -hmm. It's an absolute auction. You can come view the property beforehand at 11 to 12. The auction will start at 12 o'clock. Right. Um, and he keeps them very much on schedule, so it may be sold by 12.03. So if you want to come, come on time. <laughs> and a lot of times you can come early and look at this one, but that's not an option here. So mm -hmm. if you want to walk through this, be there at 11 a.m. Yep. because you'll only have that one hour window to, to take a look and walk through and kind of eyeball this one before you start bidding. Yes, absolutely. Now you can be um, pre-registered because you do have to register for mm -hmm. these, but you can do that even though you can't see the house beforehand, you can go ahead and call your office and pre-register. Absolutely, you can call us, pre-register, we'll go ahead and have your name down, we'll give you your number when you actually get on site, just saves you a little bit of time if you do plan on coming. And if you are the winning bidder, you've <laughs> got to be able to produce 10% down mm -hmm. that day and then you'll have 60 days to finalize that and pay in full. Yes, that's not a right. Not a bad deal. Shannon's learning all about auctions. I am. I've, I've learned so much about real estate in the last few years doing this show with you. Uh, but these fascinate me, especially the absolute auctions, because that could be the day when a piece of property um, sells for not a lot. And that could be one that you don't expect to sell, but people will get in a bidding war and could be sky high. <laughs> so these, these absolutely fascinate me. But this absolute auction on Poplar Street in downtown Pikeville, Saturday, May 18th. If anybody mm -hmm. has any questions, I'm sure they can call your office. Yes, absolutely. Give the Pikeville office a call, 606-437-2333. All right. Now, we've talked about a lot of things, but I'm going to step out, and because in your Real Estate Minute, you're going to kind of go over again all the different things that Red Brown and Williams has to offer. Red Brown & Williams is a full-service real estate agency with staff licensed or certified to assist in buying or selling all types of property, as well as residential and commercial appraisals, residential commercial property management, auctions, and consulting services. RBNW takes pride in the education and quality of our agents, appraisers, and other staff members. With offices in Louisa, Paintsville, Prestonsburg and Pikeville, we have agents ready to assist you throughout Eastern Kentucky. In addition, we invite you to our newly updated website, rbnw.com, for information on any of our real estate services, agents, and future educational offerings. Ray Brown & Williams has assisted the people of Eastern Kentucky since 1950, and we truly hope we can assist you with buying, selling, or any other real estate need in the very near future. Thank you for watching our show. We hope to see you again soon.